This car is awesome, but it does one annoying thing. It will lock itself all the time. Super annoying, especially when you lock your keys in the car. You leave it alone for like 20 seconds. It just locks it in. So I'm going to show you how to disable the electronics on this lock. It still works when you do it manually, but then when you go to lock it, all the other ones lock. But this one does not. You will need to manually lock and unlock the driver's side door, but you will never get locked out of your car. And as we can see here, I got the key in here. If you come up and you turn it, it will actually still lock it. See, unlock, unlock. But it will not electronically do that. You know, you try and lock it, nothing happens, unlock. Nothing happens. Now this thing right here, you're going to pop that out with your flathead screwdriver. And then you're going to pop that thing out. And then you have to actually stick this into there. And then pop it back in when you put it back together. Pop this thing off, go around pulling that up with your flat head, just like that, until you get this off. And then pop this thing off, and then pop this thing off. And then you're going to have one, two, three long screws in there. And then there's another one right on that. This is the short one here. Get your screwdriver in here and progressively pop those things off. Just go pop, pop. Just go all around and you can see them right there. They might take a little bit of finessing to get right, but you'll get it. Just go all the way around until this pops off. Put your thumb into that, press in like so, and pull that out. And that should come out real easy. Just lay that down somewhere. And now, when you press your lock button right there, the other locks will lock, but not that one. So now you have to manually do that every time. But it will not lock on you. And everything else should work fine. Now there are four of those clips. You see this one's blue, those ones are, and up here it is white. You're gonna have to get them off using one of these. So just to get that in there, uh, this is your trim remover tool by the way, you know, get that in there and then get the leverage on that, pop it out. And then when you put it back in together, you're gonna have to stick it on there Put it in, see there's a spot where it can slide right in, and then you just kind of bang that right in and your door panel will go back on secure. Hook this top part up onto the window sill. Push it down, and then we're gonna get those things in there like so. You just pop all them in.